Hello from San Diego Comic-Con, everyone. Perry here. And right now, I am going to talk to you about the very first episode of Castle Rock on Hulu. I only got to see a single episode, the premiere episode, so I can't really get too much into the storylines and what I'm thinking long-term for this show. But as far as an episode one goes... It has piqued my interest. I would like to see more of this and specifically spend more time in this world that's being built in this show because you guys know I'm doing a pretty, uh, a pretty lengthy deep dive into all the Stephen King I should have been reading over the years. And one of the things that's so striking about his work is how he fills out a world and fills out a world with an enormous ensemble that essentially makes you feel like you're standing there in the middle of, if I'm going to use Derry as an example, a fully realized town and I am starting to get the sense of it based on what I've seen in episode one just to give a little sense of what the actual episode is about largely focuses on Bill Skarsgård's character who happens to be found locked in a cage in a very familiar prison that you might know from other Stephen King work. And then there's also Andre Holland's character who grew up in Castle Rock as a kid. He's being drawn back to the town, but there are so many other people in play. Everyone seems like they're in a very different situation. The atmosphere is strong. It's got this really eerie sense to it. The visuals are spot on. And there's certain visuals in particular you will see for yourself when you actually see the episode that are extremely striking and really they're kind of seared into my brain right now so while I can't say episode one of Castle Rock ended in a way that has me just dying to see what happens next they've laid enough of a groundwork to make me feel absorbed in what they're starting with and have at least made me intrigued to see what happens next so those are my initial thoughts on Castle Rock on Hulu are you excited to see the show hit that comment section below share some thoughts right there as always like and share this video and we've got more Comic-Con coverage coming your way real soon.